go, folks. All the Christmas trees. to the falls. Emma's having a good time splashing in the puddles because, because it's snowing. So that means it's very cold. So we're going to get in and go check it out. All right. So as I said before, we're heading our way into the uh, we'll see some waterfalls. And right now we're going to go see the South Falls District, uh, me, historic district. It is snowing out. Back here is the little gift shop area, and uh, we're gonna go check this, check out this uh, waterfall. It's very cold, very snowy, but uh, it's gonna be beautiful. I know it is. All right, this is the beginning of the, uh, I guess, I don't even know if you can call it the trail, but just beginning to get to the waterfall. Don't know if you can hear it, but if you're standing here, it is. This is very icy right here. So Emma and I are taking our time and little Emma does not want her hands covered. So we are not, <laughs> both of us don't have any gloves on right now. I lost a, one of my gloves and Emma refuses to put on her mittens. I don't think she likes being bind down. So we're just taking our time. Snow is falling everywhere, still very pretty. There we go. It's uh, ice, but it's still kind of a slush. It's getting more slush-like. It is still snowing, but it's also coming down like a, more like rain. Slush, slush I should say. You can still see some more snow coming in over there. Okay, so here we are at the top of the waterfall. Now what's really cool about this waterfall is that you can get a complete 360 view of it. So right in here, you can see, we you can get closer, but it's pretty much that. You can see the, the beginning part of the waterfall. And we'll come over into the valley and you can actually see right over here. Uh, da -ba -ba, hold on. Over here, there's another little little tiny waterfall right here. This is, I believe it said the Trail of Ten Waterfalls. So if you do decide to take this trail, it'll lead you around. I believe it's about a 2.2 mile hike. Uh, it'll lead you around uh, all these different waterfalls. So Greg and Emma are getting just a little bit closer. I do have to be careful. Greg has better shoes than I do. I've got woo, slippery shoes. I've slipped numerous times. Thankfully, I haven't fallen, knock on wood. But as you can see, there's the water. Let me see, maybe we can get a little closer. Actually, I'm good here, I'm good here. But you can see there's water's coming from over there and it comes down. Hi! <laughs> Emma, say hi! 
<laughs> I think she's excited by the water. She's smiling. <laughs> but it falls into this canyon. So we will check that out and continue. We're not going to go all the way down. I don't know if they'll even allow that. But uh, we'll get a uh, clue so you can see the front of this waterfall. So here's a map, as I was saying. This is the, uh, the Silver Falls State Park. I don't know if I said that before. But you can see all the different trails that you can do. There's multiple, multiple trails. Different inclines. Here we said steep. And yes, <laughs> you definitely need to be careful, even in the spring, because it does get still, the ground still gets wet uh, while you're walking on it. Okay, so as I was, we were right here before looking down on the rip waterfall, but now you can see that you can actually follow these trails and the trails will actually go all the way down. Here's part of the trail right there. Sorry, focus right there. And it can actually go behind the waterfall, which is really, really cool. Uh, people go do, do that a lot in the spring. I don't know if you can even do it right now because it is snowing. But it's uh, in the water, and even sometimes in the summer, people do go swimming in the water. Now that water, even in the summer, is extremely cold. It's extremely cold, but it's still people still do it, probably because they can. So you can't tell, but on some parts, because of the pressure of the water, the snow is actually kind of almost coming up. So it's pretty cool. Now I'm going to turn around and show you this area. As I said before, the snow, it is snowing. <laughs> Do you love it, Emma? Yay! <laughs> and all this is icy slush right there that we have to walk on, so we do have to be careful. So I'm actually really glad we came today because I'm sure all of this is gonna freeze tonight and that would just be really really extremely extremely slippery. I'm gonna see if I can maybe get a little bit closer go down these little steps here we're gonna take it wide not go on the ice Woo! as I slipped right there felt that let's see yeah steps 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 you can see some more snow freeze snowing uh, I don't think I'm going to go down those steps though. I don't trust myself. But you can see the, oh, there we go. You can definitely see the bottom of the waterfall right over here. And you just continue this trail and it zigzags back all the way down there. And it just wraps around and brings you right down here. Or maybe more right down here. But sure enough, you can go uh, swimming in it very very pretty this is a very extremely uh, photographed well-known waterfall because you can get a complete 360 view of it and perhaps in the spring or summer maybe we'll come back and get behind it <laughs> Emma's going down the steps good job Emma <laughs> Daddy's holding her hand and her back of her head. <laughs> Yay, Emma! I think Emma's more excited about the steps right now. Yay! <laughs> and splashing in the puddles. <laughs> That's no <snow>, Emma. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. All right. We're gonna on our way, we're gonna be a little bit careful coming back. So right now you can really see how how much snow is actually falling. It's also also kind of a snow slush slush like. But this is just really pretty right here. It is coming down in clumps. <laughs> You can see on Greg's jacket on how clumpy it's actually getting. 
so pretty. This is an extremely easy walk to, uh, to get to when you park, and it's not very far at all to get to where you want to see the river. So it can be, or excuse me, the waterfall. And that is considered the, uh, the South Falls. Also, I don't know if I mentioned that earlier. So very, very easy walk. There's a nice paved trail. Very simple to get to. Uh, and you're welcome to do more to get into the park. It is free, but you do have to pay for parking. What that is, I don't know. So this right here is kind of slippery. I'm taking my time. Greg has better shoes, so that's why he's taking Emma. Whoop, there you go, slipped right there. walked into the little cafe and that's actually really really cool is that they have all of the maybe not all of them but a lot of the waterfalls on display so there's the north fall south fall south fall what's this one say i can't read it. my glasses are all fogged up this camp oh the lower south fall so you can see all the, you can see all these different waterfalls when if you decide to take a walk there's the uh, Drake South Fall Lodge where we're at right now right now we're gonna walk around the corner so this just seems like a little nesting area right now they're cleaning up and taking down Christmas decorations, it seems. It's very nice beams. Right now they have a fireplace going. A picture of the waterfall of snow. It's a very large fireplace. A cozy one. Just happy to walk around. What you think, Emma? You ready to go back out in the snow? I think so. <laughs> you want to get in the chair? Okay. <laughs> All right, friends, we hope you like this video. Uh, please like and subscribe. Um, yeah, I know it's one of our favorite spots is this uh, waterfall. And it's great all time of year around. So I definitely suggest you coming and checking it out sometime. All right, we'll talk to you later. Please like and subscribe. Bye.